The prevailing theme of humans in the natural world is that everything is connected to everything else. We've moved away from teaching the disciplines in isolation to enable students to put on these varied lenses. Humans in the Natural World is a freshman curriculum that brings together the natural sciences and the social sciences and the humanities for the purpose of having students understand the complexity of knowledge. When we're shifting between a scientific understanding of the world or a poetic understanding of the world, they aren't looking at those pieces as having to be isolated in order to get something out of it. We aim to integrate as much as possible between the three disciplines, which makes it so that we can go deeper. One way that we do that is to really focus on understanding the place, our place and who we are. You get to have that optimism mindset and use that and put that creativity in your work, your essays, whatever you're doing, and you get to make your idea real. So we do have a variety of ways that we give information to students. One of the ways are through spider discussions. The teacher is removed from that discussion and actually monitors the discussion. You can see them encourage each other because that's kind of the one thing about spider discussion is that in the end, every person needs to have spoken. The kids coming out of humans, their active reading skills are really good. They are also really skilled at seminar discussions, particularly at listening to each other. They developed a real skill, and I think the thing that's important about it is that it's a skill that you use all the time. It's a beautiful thing when they learn to work in a group, when they are able to do that in a way that, that gets more fluid, that's more of a, an intellectual negotiation rather than fighting over the last muffin, then the magic really happens. Maybe they feel a little freer to be curious in a disciplined way than high school kids generally feel. We leave space for a lot more possibility here, and Humans in the Natural World epitomizes that philosophy of allowing you to venture into an unknown to sort of emerge out of that, only to then get kind of thrown back into it. It's that persistent experience of confronting what you don't know that really allows us to learn and grow.